Mute recaps here. Today I will explain, a man whose body transforms into a demon and his horns possess people to live their darkest desires, movie name horns. 99% of people watched my video but did not subscribe to my channel please support me, sit back and relax, and don't forget to subscribe please. At the beginning of the movie, we see Marin Williams, radio DJ Ignatius Parrish is presumed guilty by the public and becomes a pariah in his hometown of Gideon, Lee Torno, IG's childhood friend, works as his attorney, Terry IG's jazz musician brother, supports him, but his parents, Derek and Lydia, suspects that their son is guilty. IG spends the night at the Chieftain pub with another childhood friend Glenna, IG awakens to find that he has mysteriously sprouted horns, Glenna seems unconcerned. About the growths on IG's head, IG notices Glenna feels compelled to reveal her gluttonous desires, as a result of her low self-esteem, when IG goes to the doctor, a patient confesses marital infidelity before fighting with the receptionist, IG also discovers that he can detect flashes of bad behavior in others through physical contact, the doctor and nurse act similarly ignoring the horns, and confessing their secret sins, IG recalls meeting Marin for the first time as a child in church. Marin reflects light off her gold cross pendant in the direction of IG, which Derek Parrish identifies as Morse code. IG discovers Marin's cross pendant in the pew where she sat after the service. IG recalls a childhood memory of spending an afternoon at the river with Terry, Lee, Glenna, and Eric, also known as Meat Bag. In exchange for Eric's last cherry bomb, Eric dares IG to ride naked in a shopping cart down the log ramp leading into the water, IG succeeds, but is trapped beneath. Floating logs, before being rescued by Lee, later Lee repairs the cross pendant so that IG can return it to Marin, IG drops the cherry bomb on Lee in order to distract him from his own feelings. For Marin, while he accidentally blows two fingers off his hand with the cherry bomb, IG and Marin begin their romance. IG shows Marin a treehouse in the woods that will serve as their hideout, and IG admits that Lee fixed the cross in exchange for the fireworks, but Marin admits that she left the pendant for IG to find on purpose. IG notices Lee can't see the horns on his head and assumes it's because Lee is too nice. During emotional confrontations with his parents, IG discovers that his Father destroyed, a forensics lab believing he was destroying evidence proving IG's guilt when in fact it would have cleared him IG starts a fist fight between news crews competing for an exclusive interview capitalizing on the craziness he inspires in others. IG discovers that the main witness against him is Veronica, a waitress at Eve's family diner who served both IG and Marin on the nightmare and was murdered. IG then agrees to let bar owners stand to burn down the Chieftain pub in. Exchange. For the insurance money, IG recalls the night he planned to propose to Marion at the diner. When Marin arrives, she informs IG that she is leaving him and moving to Los Angeles. Marin lets IG believe she is going him. For another man, IG is enraged and frustrated. As he drives away, IG awakens the following day with a hangover in his car parked near the river, Eric who is now a police officer, informs him that Marin has died. IG confronts Veronica in the diner and discovers that she is lying about what happened with Marin in order to become famous as the star witness in its trial. IG then goes to the Duke nightclub to see his brother and learns, for the first time that Terry drove away with Marin after IG left the diner, Marin got out of the car when they were close to the treehouse in the woods, Terry awoke the following day in his car, holding a bloody rock, and having no memory of what had happened before discovering Marin's body in the woods, IG notices Lee wearing Marin's cross while telling Lee what he has learned so far, and realizes that this is what makes him immune to the horn's powers. Marin gave Lee the pendant because they were having an affair. Lee tells IG then attempts to question Marin's father Dale about what was truly going on with his daughter, but Dale only confirms his Hatred for IG, IG notices that snakes congregate in his presence, as punishment for vanity, he uses the snakes to bite Veronica and deform her face, IG then diverts the attention of a police officer, 
by compelling Eric and his partner to finally admit their homosexual attraction to one another, IG also forces his brother to an overdose on drugs as punishment for not telling anyone about being the first to discover Marin's body. During a struggle with IG, Marin's cross falls from Lee's neck. Lee is forced to admit that he murdered Marin after being freed from the pendant's protection. We confronted Marin at the treehouse following her altercation with IG at the diner. Marin refused Lee's advances, which resulted in Lee raping and killing her. Back in the present, Lee Khan finds IG inside a car, ignites it and drives it into the water. The town concludes that IG committed suicide. Lee claims he was the only witness and that IG confessed to his crimes before committing suicide. IG pulls himself from the river, deformed from the immolation, and goes to see Dale Williams. Dale gives IG a letter she left for him after realizing IG is not Marin's murderer. IG then puts on Marin's cross and returns to his normal human form. In the treehouse, IG reads Marin's letter and discovers that the real reason she broke up with him was because she had cancer. Marin didn't want IG to go through what her father went through when her mother died. Lee is confronted by IG, who leads him to the treehouse. Terry and Eric also appear, with the truth revealed, the four men engage, in a struggle, Eric's head is accidentally severed by an Aaron shotgun blast, and IG transforms into a fallen angel with wings, after removing Marin's cross, Lee tries to defend himself, against IG's attacks, but is eventually consumed by a snake that crawls down his throat, Terry survives the battle, while IG accepts his fate as a fallen angel. This movie in here. Thanks for watching.